I'm Dave Harris. I'm a police sergeant in Richmond, California. Richmond, unfortunately, has quite a bit of gun crime, and that's been a problem in this city for many years. Technology is certainly an aspect of what we use to help serve this community. And one of those technologies that we use is the shot spotter system. We work with the city or the customer to establish what coverage area they want. We find good locations to put sensors up on top of buildings. The acoustic sensor will pick up the event, recognize it as a gunshot, it sends an alert to the shot spotter monitor, which grabs the attention of the dispatcher sitting close to it. Two Lincoln Five. The alert identifies the location of the gunshot, the number of gunshots. They get the sound, they look at it on the map. So as the officers are responding to the scene, they kind of know what they're about to get into. Before shot spotter, if you're out here and you're driving in a car, you've got this window open, you don't have any other windows open, you're hearing gunfire. It's gonna sound like it's over here. It's very frustrating because those seconds and minutes are critical to saving somebody's life. The information is sent out to the officers in the field. For instance, in this case, the broadcast goes out that there's a shot spotter hit on 10th and Lucas. This is a very large shot, so when I play this, you'll hear how large this weapon is. When the officers pulled into this intersection here, the first thing they found was a body on the ground. The officers started asking the dispatcher, you know, where should we go? How should we look at the scene? Where exactly did shot spotter say? And in this case, shot spotter is saying it's on the rooftop. They found the perpetrator. Um, he was still sitting up there. He was smoking cigarettes. Um, he was disassembling his weapon, but he was not making any um, attempt to flee. He really believed that he was going to be able to get away later when everybody left. I think it's a smart technology, uh, and specifically in the way that it filters out other ambient sounds that are not gunshots. I can play you a, a scenario here. That would be an incident coming in right this second somewhere. Oh, it's a firecracker. To date this year, we've been involved in helping get medical aid to 67 people that they believe would have died had they not been brought to the scene immediately. It's clearly part of uh, the future and of technology coming in and enhancing our performance. We're a tool. We're just like the gun and the radio and everything else they carry out there to do their job. But we are giving them intelligence that helps them save lives and helps them save their own lives. And so I think it's a smart technology, but it's also the smarts of the people that are using that technology. Ten four.